Hi, I'm Simon Evans and today I'm going to be talking to you about The Lincoln Lawyer. So a while ago, I remember getting quite excited because I discovered that Michael Connolly was going to do this this one show thing where he's going to do a book reading prior to a showing of the movie of The Lincoln Lawyer, which is, you know, of his book. Hey, Michael Connolly speaking at the... the in Auckland. Oh, brilliant. That's awesome. Then I remember the disappointment that I had when I discovered that there weren't any tickets left. <sighs> Not only that, but... Oh, you'll see. That can't be right. It's not coming out in the cinemas at all? Oh, no. For goodness sake. Yep, that's right. The movie didn't even hit theatres across the country. So if you know me, right, you know that I'm a movie buff and I enjoy a good crime drama kind of thing in the book format. So I looked at the reviews and I did some of the write-ups about The Lincoln Lawyer and I thought, yeah, I'll give that one a go. I can proudly say that this last holidays I managed to purchase and then devour that Lincoln Lawyer novel. In fact, I, I could barely put it down. It was so good. If anybody asked me for, you know, like a little soundbite thing, I would say that this novel here goes head-to-head -head with any of those John Grisham novels that you could put a hand to. I can't remember the last novel that I literally could not put down, okay? So um, this is, you know, I just thought it was absolutely brilliant. There is um, a sequel to The Lincoln Lawyer. It's called The Brass Verdict. So I'm really looking forward to getting my hands on that and uh, and plowing my way through that. There's going to be some links in the doobly-doo to other useful um, links and sites and all that sort of stuff down there. So go check it out. Okay, I'll catch you guys next time. Take care. Don't forget to subscribe.